What's up, everypony? It's your old friend Brony Burning Axe here from Brohoof Productions. No, just kidding. It's me, Raptamon132, and welcome to another blind reaction to episode 2 of Major League Pony. Yep, the famous uh, abridged series created by Brony Burning Axe. Hope I didn't sound that. Hope my impression of him didn't sound that bad. Ah, who cares? Anyway, uh, anyway, uh, today I'm going to be reacting to episode uh, two of Major League Pony. It's uh, Making Friends Part Two. I've been waiting for a long time for this episode to come out, and uh, today I just got the opportunity to actually do it. The funny thing is, before I start, I'll tell you a little story. For the past week or so, I've been wanting to do a blind reaction to this, but every time I had the chance to do so, I had certain complications, like my sister with my five-year-old niece staying over, and uh, then I was about to do it uh, again today. Actually, I was going to do it yesterday and the day before, but certain complications prevented me from doing it. But since my uh, parents and uh, gone for a while, and uh, since I've got the house to myself and I've got nothing to disturb me, I am actually going. I have the opportunity to actually do this uh, blind reaction video now. Yeah, so anyway, uh, last time I reacted to episode one, today I'll be re reacting to episode two. And uh, yeah, like I said, I've been waiting forever for this, fi for this episode to come out, but you know with uh, Brony Burning Axe uh, busy with everything else, uh, it's, um, you know, it takes a while. But uh, anyway, right now I'm going to react to uh, episode two and uh, see what, what it's like. So without further ado, let's begin. Here we go. Brohoof Productions. Those of you that would like to do a blind reaction to this, please feel free to and send me a link when you're finished. Thank right. you. This video contains right strong language and blood. Viewer discretion is advised. Man, this is a fan-based parody. Please support <laughs> that official release, dog. Previously on Major League Pony. I need a friend. What? Gasp, a book. Huh? The main antagonist for the first two episodes will make us the perfect candidate for my friend. Uh, no, seriously, what? Let's go. We're here. Well, that was fast. <laughs> <laughs> what? Ooh, look, a farm! I'm Southern! Okay... How did we get here? <laughs> Sup? Hello, would you like a blowjob? <gasps> what? <laughs> what I need to know is if my middle name is Bitch. Don't question it. You have a nice ass. Thank you! <laughs> yeah. Can I be a gangster? Yeah. Cool. Oh, hey, look, I'm breaking into the library. Speaking of which, where's the damn light? Hey, I'm Pinkie Pie, and there's no time to explain because the scene is about to change. What? Uh, oh. Insert evil laugh here. Ha ha. Wa ha ha. Oh, oh, oh look, a friend! Hey, touch. wanna be friends? Ah. Hell no! Oh. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, here it is. <laughs> Wilhelm <laughs> scream. <laughs> you forgot your free blow job. I'll just turn it down a little bit. Does he want seconds? Sec. <laughs> I gotta get that plot. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta get, get some that sleep, plot. my little gangster. Rarity's plot nice is on baby. mine now. <laughs> That's his real name. But first, I need to find out where Nightmare Moon went. Hey, I have a question. Do you want a second rain blow job? Well, is that a yes? Whoa! <laughs> Sorry about that. RD here lost her manners long ago. I overheard she was looking for Nightmare Moon, though. Well, I spotted where she went. And where might that be? <laughs> the Everfree Forest! Forest! For dum dum dum! <laughs> I could just imagine that being inserted there. Dum dum dum! Oh, anyway, sorry, continue. Ooh, an echo! What? It didn't work for me. <laughs> the echo only works if you say forest. Forest. Hmm, let <laughs> me try. Forest. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> huh. Awesome intro as usual. Ah, Coraline Slime does, uh does Nightmare Moon and, uh, and Celestia. Interesting. Uh, 
so, um, any of you know any ghost stories? No. Ghost stories? No, oh, that's absolutely outrageous to assume such a thing of me. No, <laughs> but I know a knock knock joke. Ooh, I do so love a knock knock. Hey, I have one. Ever hear 69? Heard of it? I tried! See if only tried it once, they were attacked during their climax! <laughs> <laughs> this is too much. It's obvious Brony Burning Axe made um made Rainbow Dash in this seem like a like a sexual crit a sex addict. Yeah, you know, talking about blowjobs, 69s. Ingenious. <laughs> it's so... It's, it's too much. Hey, sorry. Continue. Not my fault, I swear. Tell that to the judge. <laughs> Tell that to the judge. <laughs> oh. Whoa. Hold your horses. I'm a coming. That's Shit. what she said. I'm gonna die. I'm too important to die. I'm too important to die. <laughs> Let go, and you'll be fine. Bitch, you're crazy! No, I'm Southern. Uh, but didn't you say you're a master? <laughs> oh, you know, I forget it. But seriously, though, you're our main <laughs> protagonist, right? Uh, yes. And this is a cartoon, correct? Yeah. Well, main protagonists don't die in cartoons, so you'll be fine. Wow, <laughs> I'm amazed I didn't think of that myself. She is so gonna die. <laughs> well, here's your milk on her face. <laughs> I was up all night last night thinking about the Wonder Bolts. Oh, my plot is still killing me from that fall, and your talking isn't helping. <laughs> Who's that Ponymon? Ponymon. Hey, just a second. Who is running this series? This is My Little Pony, not Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> Who said it couldn't be fun? Fourth dimension broke. Uh, that's stupid. You're stupid. What? Too bad. Roll the episode. <laughs> Pokemon reference. <laughs> Missed. No, Apple bug. Take that, you ruffian. <laughs> Use roar. Oh shit! <laughs> Used raw. Giddy up. Yeehaw! Get along, little whatever the hell you are. <laughs> Attack My fell. Turn. Brain blow job. <laughs> Your rain blow job failed. <laughs> Too much. <laughs> she tears it. Meanwhile, in Tomb Raider 2. Ooh. Oh, I get terrible wind. <laughs> Meanwhile, what? back at the plot. That is not what I meant. Hey, there she go, shaking that ass on the floor, bumping and grinding that pole. The way she's grinding that pole. <laughs> you really hope I don't step in any dog shit. Well, shit, I just jinxed myself. So, now I have the chance to talk about this. Do you girls think I'd make a very convincing gangster? <laughs> Hell no. My answer? Hell no. Shit no. Fuck no. Goddamn no. God damn no. no. <laughs> That'd be my answer to Fluttershy in this. Anyway, sorry, continue. Oh, would you look at that? I stepped to dog shit. <laughs> it's just dog shit. Oh shit! <laughs> now let's see what happens with uh, the song. Ah, uh, ooh. Pinky, are you fucking crazy? Run! 
Or, you know, stand around like us for no reason. Don't worry, girls. I got this. And how exactly do you plan on doing that? You got some fucking magic in your butt? It's really very simple, girls. I just laugh at these trees and they explode. <laughs> Explode? That sounds cool and everything, but that's impossible. Well, stand back, Rainbow Dash, because I'm about to impress you. All I have to do is hop over to these trees like so, and... What are you doing here? A very brief cameo. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> so there's I no song. Impression, didn't I? Are you? Well, are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Well, if you're still having doubts, then I guess I can persuade you of this. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> Nuclear explosion. <laughs> so there's no song in this, huh? <laughs> I was expect I was kind of expecting uh Brony Burning Axe to actually do a song in this. Life isn't some cartoon musical where you sing a little song and your insipid dreams magically come true. So let it go. Oh well. Still good either way. But, you know. Then again, Brony Vaniax can't really sing. Well, uh, uh, Brony Vaniax, if you're watching, no offense to you. So, uh. Anyway, uh, yeah, sorry. Let's continue. <laughs> Nuclear. Well, did I impress you or what? <laughs> oh, you impressed them alright. Totally speechless. Success tastes so sweet. <coughs> Rubber ducky. Still haven't forgotten that catchphrase. <laughs> How are we gonna get I... across this? Ah, the sea serpents. <laughs> my life is over. Over, I say. Pardon our intrusion, Who? my good man. But could you please Who's... stop causing waves? Me and my good man are running guy? across this river. I'd love to, but I lost part of my moustache. Who does... I don't know who does. who's doing the voice of this guy like in the Upbridge series, but I could tell it's probably not Brony Burning Axe. It's somebody else. It's probably Coraline Slime. Well, maybe. Or it might be uh, another one of his... Another one, but uh, I might have to check the credits if it's there. Anyway, continue. And my moustache is what gives me my magical powers. Without <laughs> them, this lake shall forever be in total chaos. Couldn't you just, you know, stop wagging your serpent tail? Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> <laughs> Great, you got me all wet. Sorry for stealing your thunder, Artie, but uh, that's what she said. Uh, stop <laughs> that, you, I've got a plan. Ahem. Hello there, Mr. Um, what's your name? They call me Stephen Magnus. Whoa, well, isn't Ste that just a darling little name? Stephen Magna? Stephen Magna? <laughs> what kind of stupid name is that? <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh well. I, that's probably just his, uh, that's probably just a name that that Brony Burning Axe made up or something. Anyway, continue. Why, thank you. You said you were having a <laughs> thank birthday, you. correct? Honey, the worst. Well then, there's no <coughs> way it could possibly get any better for you. Ow! You bitch, that fucking hurts. <laughs> That's the <laughs> idea. <laughs> what the goddamn shit just happened? I was simply getting rid of our little river problem. But did you have to be such a bitch about it? You forget, my dear. My middle name is Bitch. And I'm to live up to my potential. Question. Middle name huh? is Bitch. What's your last name? Oh, um... You don't have one, do you? <coughs> I do? I don't think you do. Well, it's a secret, and I'm not telling. I think you're full of shit. No! Yes! Oh my god, look! A scene change! Scene change. <laughs> Fourth Whoa, wall break. Whoa, spooky castle. Spooky castle? Check. Ominous background music, check. I'm betting that's where Nightmare Moon is. Let's go! Yeah! Yep. Last no one doubt. there's a fucking loser. Whoa! I'm guessing you have a weird fetish for falling to your death, am I right? <laughs> no. I just hate my life and I want it to be over. <gasps> Don't
Don't do it. Choose life. I was joking. I'm not so stupid to take my own life. <laughs> uh, girls. Oh, what would do we you? Do? Wings. Touche. <laughs> Touche. Knock, knock. Who's there? Dover. Dover who? Bend over and we'll give you a big surprise. We have Rub -a -ducky. the biggest. Yep. Thickest. Hang on, yes. hang on mm. a minute. Hang on. I think I know who does the voice of the... Who's doing the voice of that. I think it might have been... Uh, might have been Brony Burning Axe's boyfriend. Uh, oh, girlfriend, sorry. Sorry, uh, girlfriend. I think it might have been uh, Brony Burning Axe's girlfriend uh, before they split. That was uh, Rainbow Strike. Or she's known by another name now. But um, I think that must she, he must have decided to use that original recording. Or well, at least I hope. Or it might be somebody else completely entirely. Anyway, I'll just have to check the uh, credits to find out. Anyway, continue. Yest and longest. Yes? <laughs> Don't stop, go on. Cox. Woohoo! Cox! Wait. <laughs> what? You're a mare. Yes, but I have two stallions here. Sorry, but I'm only interested in foursomes and gangbangs. You don't have enough cocks to qualify, and I'm not into mares. So oh. thanks, but no thanks, but I'm saving myself for group sex. <laughs> <laughs> it's too rich. Whoa. <laughs> this place is gorgeous. I gotta get me one of these. All right, girls, don't touch a thing. It could be like a trap in the <coughs> doom or some shit. Uh, Excuse oh, me. Oh, great, yes, just fucking ignore me. Now be careful. Looks like you were wrong, Twilight. Nothing bad happened at all. Pinky, what did I just not say yet. not to do? Touch anything. And what did you do? Touch something. Exactly, and you <laughs> all touch something. That's the exact opposite of touching nothing. Quit your bitching, Nancy. Gee, thanks, AJ. Now do me a favor and piss off. <laughs> that goes for all of you. You're only getting in my way. Come on, girls. Nancy, no friends, needs some alone time. Stupid ponies. Maybe if they'd listen to me, I wouldn't have to waste my precious time remembering the levitation spell to put these balls uh, back in their place. Man. Oh, man, it's getting drafty in here. Did some pony leave a window open? <laughs> oh, shit. Fuck! <laughs> And now the fight. So, this is where you've chosen for your final resting place. Actually, I'm not tired. That's not what I meant by rest, you buffoon! So, what exactly <laughs> are those things? These are the elements of harmony. Hey, wait a minute. The magical gem. I recognize the background music playing. I know it. That's the theme for evil Margin Boo from Dragon Ball Z. I recognize it. Like Brony Burning Axe must must be playing a uh, a different must be playing an alternate version of it, like uh, playing in a different uh, note. At least I hope that's where it, what it is. But yeah, I recognise that theme music playing. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, sorry. Continue. Things that stopped my tyranny long ago. I'll make sure yep, no it pony is. uses their power against me. Yeah, 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 that's real interesting, but I have something important to say. Of course. Even filth like yourself should be permitted to convey your last words. <clears throat> it took me long enough, but I finally found you, Nightmare Moon. I, Twilight Sparkle, have traveled a perilous journey to get <laughs> here. I've searched far and wide, high and low, battled <laughs> hideous monsters, slaying a sea serpent and battling a ferocious manticore. And now that I've found you, you are going to be my friend. Are you for real? Bitch, I'm the real MVP. You want to be my friend? Yes! <laughs> I... I've never actually had a friend before. I've always been in solitude. 
You have no idea what it's been like trapped on a deserted rock, destitute for a thousand years. <laughs> no other ponies or animals to keep me company. I started to go uh -huh. frantic. There was no other being there for me in my darkest days. All I had for company was a That's small sad. meteorite named Waffles. Oh, how I miss him so. Ah! Even if he was yep. just a That's obviously a Castaway reference. <laughs> she based, He based it on the, uh, the beach ball from uh, Castaway. <laughs> I recognize that reference anywhere. Anyway, continue. A rock. Truthfully, I could do with an ensemble of allies. So yes, Twilight Sparkle, I would like nothing more than to be your friend. You you really mean that? No. <laughs> you honestly <laughs> think that coming. little sentiment could stop me so easily? Ha! You're sadly mistaken. <coughs> Friendship? Bleh! It's such a sickening display of vulnerability and benevolence. <laughs> I shall never succumb to such a feeble attempt to befriend me. I am Nightmare Moon, and compared to me, you're nothing more than an insect. You've <laughs> given me no choice, then. A fight. Oh, this is rich. You're going to fight me? <laughs> I'll gladly send you to an early grave. Hey, bitch. Yes? Where'd you go? <laughs> this way. Love to see how the fight scene goes down. <laughs> She's getting her getting ass handed yet? to her. Nope. <laughs> nope. Oh my. I think I may have him on the run. Once more, into the breach. Time. Have you had enough yet? You know you're wasting your time, right? Actually, I'm stalling for time. Stall all you want. Your comrades' attempts will be futile against me. Hmm, she's right. They're all pretty useless. Hey, why don't you make this more fun for me? Why not charge me head on? Seriously? <laughs> you might as well ask me to construct your grave right now. Come at me, <laughs> sis. Very well. Your funeral. <laughs> Yeah. What the? <laughs> well, that was fucking easy. Let's see what these things can do. Yep. Surprise, bitch! Yeah! <laughs> <coughs> and destroys him. I was almost concerned for a moment there. But now there is no sure way for you to defeat me. You have <laughs> failed, Twilight Sparkle. As <laughs> <laughs> molest. If Maleficent was there, she would say, You poor, simple fool, thinking you could defeat me, me, the mistress of all evil. <laughs> In fact, that was actually what, uh, that line from the original series was actually based on that line. You little fool, thinking you could defeat me. Now you will never see your princess or your son. You... Poor simple fools, thinking you could defeat me, me, the mistress of all evil. Well, here's your precious princess. <laughs> yeah, what Nightmare Moon says. <laughs> sorry, but this is Major League Pony, not the original series. Anyway, sorry, continue. Twilight, <laughs> you better be up these stairs, or I swear to God I will penetrate you! <gasps> penetrate. I Money. hit my head harder than I thought, or I just discovered something unbelievable. I don't need you, I already have friends, and they're right here! Uh-huh. What's happening? Listen carefully, because I'm a goddamn genius. Rainbow Dash here is by far the most annoying pony I've ever met. And so she represents the spirit of annoying. Rarity annoying. killed a sea serpent to prove how much of a bitch she was. So she represents greed. Greed. That doesn't make any sense. Blah, blah, I don't care. Bored now, moving on. Fluttershy over here murdered a ferocious beast. So she... Brutality. Uh, um, Fluttershy, quickly, help me out. What's your element? Brutality. Oh, oh, right, yes, he's brilliant! She represents the spirit of... Uh, Pinkie Pie is monotone as fuck! But let's just fix that and call her the spirit of emotion! Emotion. We're surrounded by idiots. And Applejack <laughs> is the spirit Touché. of East. 
What? East. East. I thought you were southern again. I'm not <coughs> consistent. God damn it. Anyway, my element is. Uh, ah, fuck. I got nothing again. <laughs> Quickly, think of something. Beginning with L. How about lesbian? Yes, perfect. Lesbian. <laughs> right? Oh, come on. <laughs> And he here comes all up. the... L-E-A-G-U-E! -E. We are the Major League Ponies! Working title, and we're taking you down, Nightmare! Taste the rainbow, motherfucker! <laughs> oh, I haven't felt this bad since I took on two stallions at once! You see, I was being tag team from both directions. The one in the back was thrusting. Rainbow Dash! <laughs> <laughs> well, Rarity, would you look at that? You're right! I should start twerking! I'm a pro. I was referring to your necklace. It looks like your tramp stamp. Ooh, <laughs> butt symbol. So does yours. Gasp. Hey, how come she gets a fancy crown? Tiara. Tiara. And we just get <laughs> necklaces. Because plot convenience! <laughs> Celestia. Hey, what the? Why are none of you bowing before her? Yes, bow before me, ordinary mortals. <laughs> She's a princess. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, what she said? Princess Sunbat. So. Excuse me. Uh, so that's the. You're excused. So that's the voice that uh, Coraline Slime does for uh, Princess Celestia, or Sunbat. She's called. <laughs> Sorry, continue. That's not my name! My name is Celestia! <laughs> but I've always <laughs> called you Princess Celestia. Sunbutt. Well, not anymore! Things need changing around here! You will address me as Princess <laughs> Celestia, or I will be forced to tickle you to death! Look here, Princess, you may be an immortal that goddess, voice that he's but I refuse doing. to call you anything but Sunbutt. I dare you to call me Sunbutt one more time. Is this a trick question, Sunbutt? <laughs> God, shouldn't have said that. In fact, I think I know where he, where that line was probably inspired by. It was probably inspired by that uh, line that um, Lightning Blitz, uh, yeah, Lightning Blitz did in a uh, episode of um, like when she was going to be recruited as the heavy for Team Fortress Two Brainy Analysis. Oh, hey, cute stuff. Kind of short for a pony, aren't you? Me cute one more time. Wait, is that a dare or a request? I need to be sure because word choice is kind of important right now. <laughs> yeah, I could just imagine that's where he probably where Bernie Voting X got that line from. Well, I mean, inspired by that line. Anyway, sorry, uh, let's continue. And now she's yeah, fucking pissed. I should have just called her Celestia, and I wouldn't be in this mess. That's what you get, girl. Sunbutt knows I'm allergic to ketchup. Ha <laughs> ha chuckled Percy. You look really disgraceful. Why does she have ketchup powers anyway? What kind of magic is that? Why does it smell so funky? Each princess represents a condiment. Sunbutt's is ketchup, Moonbutt's is mustard. What about Cadence? Shush, Spike. We haven't been introduced to her yet. Right, yeah. <laughs> Too late. I'll give Sunbutt a piece of my mind. Now, say my name. Celestia. Princess. Princess <laughs> Celestia. Princess. Good. Now, I have a special mission for you, Twilight. Stay here in Ponyville yeah. and write to me every week to tell me how awesome I am. Yes, Princess. Good. Now, I must take my leave. Wait. You forgot to mention me! Oh yes, right! My sister Nightmare Moon! Princess Luna! Right, yes! Princess Luna is not evil anymore, and now we can live happily ever after and shoot rainbows out of our butts! Oh, <laughs> oh that's great, Princess Celestia! I do so love a happy ending! <laughs> that's what you think! I will have my revenge, son, but one day I will become a princess, and you will bow down to me! Or I am not Twilight Sparkle. Really? 
to be continued. I just want to thank everybody for being so patient with this episode. Okay, let's see. Uh, Dear Pixie, as um, Shadow Bolt leader, Nathan ba Bailey. Ah, uh, yeah, that's yeah, that's Brony Burning Axe's real name. Uh, spoiler alert. Okay, let's see. Apple J, Rainbow Dash, Spike, Coraline Slime. Yep. And, yeah, Dear Trixie as, oh, Dear Pixie as uh, Shadow Bolt leader. Interesting. So it took a long time, but we got there in the end. By the way, stick around for the channel because there's going to be some outtakes and a bunch of other cool stuff. Uh-huh. Let's see. Other various artists. Ah, uh, yes, I was right. Yep, he did use, um... Yeah, he did use uh, evil super boo music. Sorry. See you later. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Sorry if I'm pausing, I was reading everything. Well, what do I have to say? I'd say this is actually very fun and entertaining. And, uh, yeah, it was very, very funny. Yep, once again, Brony Burning Axe, you made a very funny episode. Can't wait to see the next one. And, uh, yeah. Thought, like, it's interesting how he made, uh, like, how he added in some references of, uh, different things and even used music that's, uh, that you rec that you can recognize from uh, different pop cultures and all of that. And it was funny seeing the fourth wall break, you know, with the, uh, you know, with the, uh, like, Pokemon, this is not Pokemon, and, like, I, it's my series, so shut up. <laughs> yeah. It was uh, funny hearing uh, Coraline Slime doing um, the voices of Princess Celestia and Princess, uh, Luna. It kind of, in fact, it kind of, um, like, with Celestia's voice, he kind of made Celestia's voice sound a little bit, uh, it sounded like, um, best person, I, the best thing I can describe it as, uh, sounding like, uh, Gon, like, she sounds, like, made her sound a little bit like, uh, Gonzo from, uh, from Muppet Baby speaking with a slight Australian accent. Yes, bow before me, ordinary mortals. You sleep with a teddy bear? <laughs> oh yeah, what's that? <laughs> Give me that. Are you all right, Camilla? Well, not anymore. Things need changing around here. You will address me as Princess Celestia, or I will be forced to tickle you to death. Apple my foot. What he needs is a bazooka. That's what uh, he or should actually no, she made her sound like. Yeah, sorry, I shouldn't say he because Coraline Slime is now, you know, a girl, so I shouldn't say he. I should pronounce a she. Yeah, so yeah, I should say that. Yeah. Anyway, um, yeah. So it was interesting to hear that, and yeah, and how like. The funny thing is with this uh, dream, this dream pick, dream pixie, that uh, that does that does the voice of. Um, I don't know if that's uh, what what uh, lightning strike calls herself, like rainbow strike calls herself now. But um, in fact, I thought it might have been dream pen. Uh, either way, I I don't know if it might be the uh, the original voice or like the original recording, or it might be something else, but, um, or it might be somebody else, but, uh, I might have to look into that, but if, uh, but, you know, if she and her, like, if, uh, Dream Pixie and, uh, and Rainbow Strike are the same per, are the same, uh, same girl, do let me know in the comments, because I want to know. And, uh, yeah, so anyway, I thought this, uh, episode was really good, and, it actually makes me inspired to actually try and do a song cover of At The Gala, 
with uh, with with me doing an impression of the main six voices, you know, because I just found out that there's no song in this. It'd be interesting to actually have songs, and so I'm going to see if I can actually do uh, voices in it and, like, you know, try to sing a song cover of At the Gala with, um, like, with, uh, with, Bro like, me doing the impressions of the main six in Major League Major League Pony. I should try to do that. And uh, hope and hopefully I should actually make a uh, a demo video of voices that I can actually do to uh, maybe, just maybe, be a, uh, a voice in this. You know, offer my, uh, you know, maybe offer my, uh, my voice to the series, you know, to, you know, help out a bit. But anyway, I'll see what comes about. Anyway, uh, I actually enjoyed this episode, and it was really good. And uh, also, major update before I go, I'll just uh, let you know that I am going to uh, start Season 2 very, very soon. Like, I'm going to start uh, posting my old brain reactions first, but uh, I'm going to do something, like, something a little creative, like, before I uh, actually do that. And... Hopefully, I'm going to... Well, I don't know whether I'll do it or not, but uh, if I do this creative thing, we'll see what comes about. But I just hope I don't get a copyright strike for it. But uh, either way, uh, I just hope that I will be able to uh, get this done. And, uh, yeah. Anyway, that's... Uh, so, anyway, like I said, uh, I'm going to start uh, doing my... Uh, recreating my old blind reactions to Season 2... And then I'm going to, like, until uh, Dragon Quest, and then I'm going to start doing uh, new episodes to hopefully catch up with everyone else. Because I'm way, way, way behind. And since there's season, season 7, it's going to be a long, long road. But hopefully I'm going to get there by hook or by crook. So, uh, and I've been doing my best to avoid every, like, to avoid any spoiler that I can. So, yeah. So, hopefully, because, you know, I've been spoiled by too much. Some of them I've been spoiled by my, my own accord, others by friends and by things on the TV. But anyway, that's my second update, and, well, that's my update to talk to you guys, to talk to you guys about, and, yeah, so that's it. I hope you enjoyed my blind reaction to episode 2 of Major League Pony and hopefully I shall get onto another thing as another video as soon as I can when I get the chance but as usual until then thank you all for watching This is Raptamon 132 saying bye bye everyone bye bye